Mary Borkin Chestnut, 1823-1886, was an American author and diarist best known for her extensive diary documenting the American Civil War. Born in South Carolina, she came from a wealthy and influential family and her marriage to James Chestnut, Jr., a prominent politician and later a Confederate general provided her with a front row seat to the events of the time. Chestnut's diary, written between 1861 and 1865, offers a unique and vivid perspective on the Civil War era, providing insights into the political, social, and personal aspects of the conflict. Her keen observations and candid reflections on the people and events around her make her diary a valuable historical document. The diary was published posthumously as a diary from Dixie and has since become an important resource for historians studying the American Civil War. In the diary of life, Every page is a new chapter waiting to be written. The pen is mightier than the sword, for it can record not only battles, but the hearts that fight them. In the tapestry of time, each moment is a thread weaving the story of our existence. Through the lens of reflection, the past becomes a mirror to our present. Words are the echoes of the soul, resonating through the corridors of history. Courage is not the absence of fear, but the triumph over it, written in the annals of the brave. In the silence between words, the deepest emotions find their voice. The ink of understanding flows from the pen of empathy. Life's diary is written not only in words, but in the spaces between them. The heart's diary is written in the language of love, eternally spoken by the soul. History is a diary written by the victors and rewritten by the storytellers. In the diary of the universe, we are but fleeting footnotes. The pen dances across the pages and in its pirouettes, stories come to life. Through the fog of uncertainty, the pen guides us to clarity. Every word written is a step taken on the journey of self-discovery. The pages of time turn, revealing the script of destiny. In the quill's embrace, the ordinary becomes extraordinary. Diaries are time capsules, preserving the whispers of the past for the years of the future. The diary of the heart is written in the language of emotions, untranslatable yet universally understood. In the symphony of life, each note is a reflection of our choices. The diary is a compass, guiding us through the labyrinth of experience. Memory is the ink that colors the canvas of our yesterdays. In the diary of dreams, we script the stories that reality dares not tell. The pen is a bridge connecting the present to the echoes of ages past. The pages of the diary unfold like petals revealing the bloom of our journey. Reflection is the ink that transforms the pages of the past into the canvas of wisdom. In the diary of the soul, each entry is a prayer whispered to the universe. Through the artistry of language, we paint our portraits on the canvas of time. The pen is a time traveler, journeying between the realms of memory and imagination. In the tapestry of existence, every knot is a moment bound by the threads of destiny. Words are the breadcrumbs we leave behind. On the trail of our existence, the diary is a dialogue between the self and the universe, a conversation written in the language of experience, in the alchemy of storytelling. Mundane moments are transmuted into golden memories. The pen is a compass, pointing the way through the wilderness of the unknown. Through the diary, we navigate the labyrinth of time, tracing the footsteps of our journey. The ink of resilience, 
writes the stories of triumph over adversity. Every word etched is a step taken in the dance of life. In the diary's embrace, the mundane becomes profound and the ordinary extraordinary. The diary is a mirror reflecting the evolution of the self. Through the diary, we navigate the labyrinth of our thoughts, discovering the treasures hidden within.